All right. God bless you. God bless you, Harvey. Because this is the disciple of Jesus Christ, the follower of Jesus Christ, the leader that Jesus appointed, that leading you to Christ. It's Shokomo. Jesus told us to lead you to him. In the book of Matthew, chapter 16, verse 24. Then said Jesus to his disciples, If any man come after me, he didn't say come after Peter, James, John. He said, If any man come after me, let him deny himself. I want to come after Jesus. I want to follow Jesus. Peter, James, John, I want to follow Jesus. What was I do? Jesus said, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. That's St. Matthew 16, 24. Here's the problem. Jesus make leaders. To lead to him. Get, get this. Get this. You wait for a company that say FedEx or let's say the let go to the highest. Let's say uh the president of the United States. You in other country, the kings, the dictators of your particular country. King, queen. King, what that boy name over there in England? Saul. King Saul. You were to lead people to them. If you're their ambassador, you will you work, they made you a leader to lead people back to them. That's why he made you a leader. Well, Jesus made us leaders to lead people back to him. Now, if those were a little too high for you, wherever you work at, get me good here. Let's see, Walmart, FedEx, UPS, what's that name over there? Oh, the one that the order stuff off of online. You made leaders. I'm a I be I be elevated to supervisor. I'm a, a team leader. I'm manager. I'm CEO. You ain't running nothing. You lead people to the company. You lead them to follow the company policies and rule the guidelines. Yeah, now you understand. I'm a high official in FedEx. You ain't right nothing. You lead them to follow the orders of Fred Smith. I'm on the board. Uh, you lead them to follow the orders of the owner. Glory to God. No matter what your opinion is, you're going to say what they said. Look at, look at. Let go of politics. My, this is all right. Boy, he's all right. Look at the Republicans. Look how all of them, and Democrats, look how all of them stay on talking points. 
I don't care what you throw at them. All of them going to say the same thing when it comes to Donald J. Trump. Look at Democrat. All of them going to say the same thing when it comes to Joseph R. Biden. The company people. Yeah, 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 you have some stragglers. I'm going to speak to you. I don't care who it would be, Republican or Democrat. If somebody say, I'm not Republican or Democrat no more, I'm in the pit. Hallelujah. No rich boy, it's all right. But look at the the competent people. They they got all of them say the same thing. Or you Democrat or what you Republican. You say the same thing. Uh -huh. Now, now that you get the picture. Jesus made leaders to lead people to show. Let's go back to politics. We got to go out and get these independent voters to come on our side. All right. Now, let's go back spiritually. Jesus made leaders to lead people to him. Jesus say, feed my, they ain't your sheep, man. They ain't your sheep, woman. They ain't your sheep, pastor, bishop. They Jesus' sheep. Jesus say, feed my sheep and feed my lamb. Jesus said, man, shall I live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the mouth of the Lord. Jesus said, if you love me, keep my command. The problem is, you are a follower. You are not a leader. You are a follower. You are not a leader. Because you don't lead people to Christ. You lead people to pastors. You lead people to not to denomination. You lead people to opinion. You lead people to seminary. You don't lead people to Christ. You don't do it. You don't do it. You don't lead people to Christ. You are a follower, not following Jesus, not following Jesus. But violent pastor and denomination. You, I had somebody tell me, matter of fact, it was in Sunday school. Someone made a statement. Going Jesus, they Jesus said, "Follow him." Now Jesus ain't here. Jesus said, "Now follow pastor." I said, "Hey, hey, cool." What did he say? Follow pastor. Jesus ain't never told you to follow no pastor. Jesus ain't never told you to follow no man. Jesus said, follow him. Jesus said, well, pastor ain't going to tell you nothing wrong. You a lot. Jesus said, be perfect. What your pastor said? You know your pastor don't say what Jesus said. Jesus said, I have mercy, not sacrifice. What your pastor say? You know your pastor tell you on God's time. Jesus ain't going to say it no more. What your pastor said? You know your pastor say, well, we all got to tell you nothing wrong. We all got to tell you nothing perfect. Uh, you see, you see, you see, he ain't saying what Jesus said. She ain't saying what Jesus said. You see, your number they didn't say what Jesus said. Jesus say, I am the son of God. God said, did my beloved son. You say, no, God, I was listening to a false prophet last night. He said, God left the throne and came down. It made a body. It got in the body. Don't Bible say that? It say Jesus left. It say God sent his own son. You, you see that? You know your pastor don't say that. See, see how he don't say what Jesus said? Hallelujah. You see your pastor don't say what Jesus said? So who they lead, who they lead you to? They, they lead you to follow them, not follow Jesus. You are a follower of man. Ha. One verse say, whether we should obey God or man, you be the judge. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You are a follower. You are not a leader. Jesus make leader. Jesus say, follow me. I'll make you fishes of me. Bring it men to him. Follow me, and I'll make you fishes of me. Not work for nobody else. But I'll make you fishes of me. Not drawing me into yourself. Not going out to make one proselyte. And when you find him and make him, you make him a two twofold child of hell than you is. Glory to God. You the problem is you're not a leader. You are a follower because you're not leading people to Jesus. You lead people to man, which is away from Jesus. Oh, she is told Paul, <coughs> you go and get up and then shall be told you what you must do. Go and inquire for one amen now. Go to Peter. Go to Cornelius. Mm -hmm. That's the problem. You're a follower. You're not a leader. You ain't no leader. One person say, when you all be teacher, you have the one teacher all over again. The first oracles of God. Not nomination. You are not not a leader. You are a follower. Fallen man. Jesus make leaders that lead you to him. Okay, well, the Bible says, follow me and I follow in Christ. And you ain't following Christ, and you ain't talking about following Christ. But the Bible says, obey leadership. You ain't talking about, how many of you say obey God? All right. That's yes enough. Jesus makes leaders. You're not a leader because you're not leading people to him. You lead people away from him. Thank you, Baby. You are a follower. You ain't no leader. Thank you, Baby. Glory to God.